I stole that sign from a high school parking lot. That's wrong. Now they can come prosecute you. What are they gonna do? <laughs> this is my bedroom, and unlike Sarah Kemp's, it is usually, it, I won't say it's always as clean, but it usually is pretty clean. It's um, probably the cleanest room in the house. Okay, saw it all, now I gotta go. I have things to do, okay? Thanks, Brandon and Will. And listen, if you have what it takes to be on Herd Homes, email us at marshall.edu slash uplate, and who knows, we might be knocking at your door. Stay with us. After the break, we're going to have Emmy Award winner Deb Novak. She's going to be with us. Don't go anywhere. Great changes have occurred at Marshall since the time of the young thundering herd. The football stadium now brims with 40,000. The marching thunder is 300 strong, and students study throughout the world. Marshall has evolved into a world-class university. It has set the stage for many students aspiring to greater heights and prepared them to perform at the highest level. Biotech, science, and the medical school have a new home for research. Tomorrow's teachers learn in future classrooms, and dorms have become learning communities with free cell phones. From library stacks to the fastest technology, information flow now comes at an instant. Yet, with the changing university, many things remain. Marshall is a safe, secure campus located in a vibrant community. That's just part of why we proudly proclaim, we are Marshall. Marshall. Thank you for staying with us. Our next guest is the award-winning producer-director that brought us Ashes to Glory and most recently, the new Cam Henderson, A Coach's Story documentary. Ladies and gentlemen, Deb Novak. Hey. 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 Oh, good. Well, thank you for being here. Oh, it's a pleasure to be here, Jamie. What is this award you just won? Well, are you familiar with World Fest Houston? Yes, I am. It is just a huge competition down in Houston, Texas. 4,500 entries. They tell me from 33 countries. And Cam Henderson, a coach's story, managed to win the first place Platinum Award down there. So we're real. Thank oh, you. Congratulations. We're really thrilled yeah. with that. Congratulations. Well, well, tell me, I mean, what is this Cam Henderson, a coach's story? What is this about? Well, I've always been fascinated with Cam Henderson and his story. You know, Dr. Sam Clagg wrote his biography about 1980, which I read. Um, and um, we, I, you know, I grew up on Marshall's campus. And uh, my mother taught at Marshall. And for a treat, she would take me to the Shockey Student Union. And I'd look up and I'd see this blue and red banner that said National Champions 1947. And I always wondered about it because few people know that Marshall won a national championship in basketball mm -hmm. in 1947. And it was Cam Henderson who was the coach of that team. So all my life I wanted to investigate Cam Henderson. We finally got the opportunity to do it. Now this wasn't an overnight type of project. No, this, took, no. this took a while. It was three years of research, three years of long, hard research. Well, it paid off though. <laughs> <laughs> I right guess now, so. It's off. And uh, we visited about 25 libraries. Uh, we went all over the country via the internet. And uh, the thing people have to realize is when they see the documentary, they're going to see some film footage of Cam Henderson. And it is extremely rare. It's not like you can go down to the footage store and find Cam Henderson. It just does not exist. So just about every frame that we found, we've used and it's in on the this, documentary. It's, it's on this DVD right here. Yes, available from the Marshall Bookstore. Shameless commercial, shameless promotion for there the DVD. Right and it has four bonus features on it. Uh, one is just the preview audiences have loved. It's called Huntington in the 1950s. And Jamie, let me tell you, it just takes you back to a different world. Of course, that's when Cam Henderson was coaching in the 1950s. And uh, we cut together about a 15-minute video on what this city actually looked like from like 1950 to 1955. Hard at work, aren't you? Oh, yes. Now, Busy bees. Now, 
I mentioned, you know, the Houston Award. Yes. What's coming up now? There's another big award ceremony you might be nominated for. What's oh, coming up? Oh, well, we don't know yet. There no. might be some others in the future, but we don't, we don't know You don't for like sure. to talk about well, it before Well, no, that. no, yeah. Because really, you know, you never know. When you send your work out, is it going to resonate with the judge? Is the judge going to like it? Um, you have, it's just, you know, just throwing it into the air and hoping something comes up. But fortunately, that we did resonate with the judges down in Houston, so we can be very proud of that. Well, in case there's any judge Watching us, watching us right now. Why don't you <laughs> plead, plead your case real quick right there in your camera. Plead your case. We worked so hard. Nights, weekends. At times you throw the thing across the floor and say, no more, no more Cam Anderson. Then you go pick it up and start again. <laughs> was there was there ever a point when you thought, you know what, this is let's just stop this project. We're too oh, far in. I bet there many, was. Many, yeah. many times where it looked like, you know, we're so over budget. We went way over budget on it because Mama Novak here blew the budget on special effects. But, um, you know, there was just so many times it was like, what are we doing when we're late nights and you come in and it's midnight and you're in the edit suite and you're bleary-eyed looking at it. But, uh, but we stuck with it. We persevered, just like we did with Ashes to Glory. And uh, I think everybody's really proud of the results. Does, is, does this documentary have as good as following as Ashes to Glory? Well, it's just come out. So I don't know yet. You know, we'll see. But I will say this, the sales have been fabulous. We went through our first run of DVDs, and really all we have left, it's what's out there in the stores right now. So if anybody's interested in seeing the Cam Henderson documentary, I recommend that you go to your local bookstore in the Huntington area and pick up a copy, because that's really all we have left. Unbelievable. Well, we actually have a clip. Oh, You, you brought a clip with us. What are we going to see? This is the part of the title sequence, uh, and you will see the special effects, which cost us so much money. Uh, and uh, so this is this is introing the pre-titles and pre-titles that intros the show. Can we take a look at yeah, that? Yeah, this will be exciting. It's going to be right up here. Okay. Let's take a look. Cam Henderson belonged to a different era. He's a legend and one of the greatest coaches of all time. Cam Henderson invented fast break. He invented his own defense and he did it before anyone else. The old man changed the games we play and made them what they are today. Exciting. Well, I bet you're very proud of I, it. Oh, thank you. Yes, I'm, I am very proud of that sequence. We're good. Now, again, where can we pick it up again? It will be available at the Marshall Bookstore, right on Marshall's campus. So I hope people will get copies of the DVD. Yeah. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Thank you, Thanks for coming okay. on our show. All right.